Okay, this is a quick video based on a chapter one quiz. And it's actually a true story. One of my first jobs was a research assistant in 1982, and I was asked to check the calibration of a thermocouple using some boiling water. So on day one, I plugged the thermocouple into the thermocouple reader and boiled the water, and I measured 100 degrees C. So the next day, I came back with the same instrument in the same location, with the instrument set up exactly the same way, and I measured 99.4 degrees C, which was very concerning at the time. And the quiz question is, what likely caused this poor repeatability? Was it a change in the boiling point of the water? Must it be a poor quality instrument? Or was it a change in the room temperature? So spoiler alert, you might wanna pause here and make your choice before I give the answer. So the answer is, it was a change in the boiling point of water that I failed to recognize. What had happened is on day one, it was a nice sunny day and the pressure was maybe 101.3 kPa and uh, I measured 100 degrees C. And then the next day, it was a rainy day and the pressure was 99.5 kPa and water at that pressure boils at 99.4 degrees C. Recall from your thermodynamics course, as well as our discussion of uh, vapor pressure, that the boiling point of water, the saturation temperature of water, is a function of pressure. In a previous video, I also discussed that, for example, at the top of Mount Everest over 8,000 meters, the pressure is about one third of an atmosphere and water boils at about 70 degrees C. So remember that the boiling point of water is a function of the absolute pressure. So I hope you got that right. If you didn't get it right, you shouldn't feel bad. As you can see from this quiz question, which is basically the same question, that most of my students did not get this right. Most of my students who have taken a course in thermodynamics for some reason thought it was a change in the room temperature that caused the boiling point of water to change, which of course is incorrect. And that completes this video.